Good morning, everyone. 6.32, it's 41 degrees. I just finished packing up. That's all I got. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> we got a big, long day today. Starting out with a big climb, but then supposedly... What happened? Did you see that? Uh-uh. Did you? No. The GoPro just had a glitch. Oh. Anyway, um, starts off with a big climb, and then supposedly it's little climbs yeah for the rest of the day all right so we have 20 miles uh 4357 feet of ascent and 3136 feet of ascent like she says gonna go like this and it's gonna go like yeah maybe and that's uh we got yeah probably got anything yeah looking forward to it <laughs> sure um yeah. I was gonna ready? say I was gonna say the temperature, but it's forty one, I already said oh. it. Sorry. And it's clear skies so nah. far. Yeah. Alright. Alright, let's roll. All right, we just got done having uh, lunch back there by um, the uh, Four Four Peaks Wilderness uh, boundary. So we're leaving it. And with that, I'll talk to you guys about some information about the, the Four Peaks now that we're not like climbing straight up through them. You can see, uh, see some of them behind us right here. Um, so, uh, as we've talked about many times before already, you know that uh, there's a lot of battles, you know, between the Apache and um, U.S. soldiers and stuff. Well, towards the late uh, 1800s, they were starting to force them into reservations, um, and there was resistance by some of the Apaches and the uh, Yavapas. And in 1872, uh, after an extended battle, a group of them went into a cave to, uh, to rest. 
and uh, Major William Brown uh, had tracked them to the cave. He was below below them, and so he instructed his uh, soldiers to shoot up into the cave and uh, have the bullets ricochet off of the uh, the top of the cave, and then uh, subsequently hit them in there and. They killed uh, most of them, and some of them surrendered. Uh, but that cave is known as uh, the Cave of Skulls, or uh, Skeleton Cave. Um, I don't know, it's on the southern side of uh, Four Peak Wilderness, if anybody's interested in where it is. Uh, but also, in the Four Peaks, is uh, a private amethyst mine. And uh, they st so it's still used today. And I guess that they use helicopters to uh, lift the amethyst out um, because it's in such a uh, remote area. But that mine was rediscovered in the 20th century. It originally was a mine that the Spanish had and uh, legend has it that the uh, one of the jewels in the Spanish crown comes from uh, the mine up there. So. If you guys are interested, you could look that up. Uh, we got about nine and a half miles left today and uh, we'll see what else we have. To Little Pine Flat. That's the name of our camping area for the night. We did exactly 20 miles. Ooh, ooh. Our first 20, right? Yeah. First 20 on the AZT. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're all set up. There's Rob right there, and then we're right here. There's like a really little creek right behind us, and yeah, a lot of spots for camping. Me and Rob are cooking dinner. Right now, I'm having ramen, he's having rice and spam, and Kevin is smoking a cigar again. I'm having a Gurkha rabbit. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna eat dinner, probably hang out, they're gonna game, and we're gonna go to, and I'm gonna go to bed. Trail gaming. That's about it. What about the day? Oh, so, okay, so the day was, started off steep, uh, it's very windy right now, but the last like what seven miles was a road walk seven right. about six or seven um, The trail was just this dirt road. There was like um, ATVs and dirt bikes and stuff going by us, but that was all right um, Once we got up the super big uphill in the morning it was kind of like an up, down, up, down, like we said. So it wasn't super bad, but I don't know. It was a very long day. The road at the end kind of saved the day and made it seem nice and easy. Good job. Wicked cool views of all day. Super groovy. Yeah, it wasn't bad for a honestly. It's pretty the whole way. Do you got any other thing before we sign off for the night? Nothing here. Nothing, babe? Got anything before we sign off? Oh, the so the storm tomorrow is supposed to arrive at 3 a.m. now instead of earlier. So we got the setup dry. We'll be walking. We'll be yeah. We'll definitely be walking in the rain tomorrow. So yay! Looking forward to for that. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, <laughs> we'll uh, close this out and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Say bye. Bye. Say bye, Rob. Bye. Hate is gonna hate. Hate is gonna hate.
All right, we made it to Little Pine. Little Pine Flat.